Hello YouTube, this will be a small unboxing video of some um, linear rails that I ordered, some HDR15 and HDR25, as well as some sliding blocks um, and some ball screws in this um, standard plastic DHL bag. And inside this bag we have this cartridge box. And inside this cartridge box we have um, smaller cartridge boxes that hopefully contains the sliding blocks. So let's open one up and check them out. say that um, this packaging was um, surprisingly good I did forget the tripod in the garage so it's a bit hard to open them with one hand but with a sharp knife it's it gets um, a bit easier This knife actually is super nice. It's got some VG10 steel. If you are into that, really like that knife. Wow. This packaging actually is one of the best that I ever received stuff in from China so super happy with that let's see if I got what I ordered it should be size 25 and with a flange yep Nice. All right, so a tip from me. I did order some linear rails um, and sliding blocks earlier. And uh, that time I ordered them in one package. They were delivered um, mounted on the rail. And there were two rails with uh, sliding blocks um, taped together. But uh, the sliding blocks weren't uh, attached uh, hard enough, so they had uh, moved a lot during the transportation um, and damaged linear rail uh, that were attached here. So by ordering uh, the blocks and the rail separately, I hope to avoid these scratches in the rail. At least um, I hope the rail to show up scratch free, but uh, we will see. All right, so UPS just arrived with the last two parcels. So let's open package number two. And it seems to be well packaged as well. It's a um, small kit of um, ball screws and um, linear rails. This is what the second package contained. Two, four, six, eight sliding blocks with a flange for HGR15 rail. And there should be longer rails uh, in the third package. One ball screw should be a longer one in the third package as well, and some stuff for the ball screw. And we can see that um, 
plastic is a bit damaged, so I guess that the sliding blocks uh, did move around some during the shipping. But uh, yeah, let's open the third package and see what it contains. So here we have the third package and before I open it I can shortly mention that these sliding blocks and guide rail here are going to be used on my floor tile lathe project. And um, it's kind of delayed since I made a similar order like this one from Banggood in the end of May. And um, I was hoping to get it and uh, start to build, but it never showed up. So I contacted their custom service and they told me to wait and wait and I waited and um, eventually I asked for a refund and uh, they asked me to accept the refund, which um, I did, but nothing happened. So I waited one more month and um, eventually through PayPal, I got the money back. So that's why the floor tile lathe project is kind of delayed, I kind of lost the interest uh, when I didn't get the stuff that I ordered. I am a student so I had to wait for getting the money back before I could order the new one. But yeah, enough of talking, let's check the third package. We should have some uh, HDR25 annual rates for these uh, larger blocks that I showed earlier. I had to put the phone down, but looks um, looks well packaged. So the rails and the ball screw is taped together inside some plastic protective film or some plastic bag. And uh, yeah, might be some scratches from the ball screw sliding around. It does move a bit. So, don't like that really, but um, it will be interesting to see if um, these rails here are scratch free when they are delivered without the sliding blocks on them. So let's open it up and check it out. Here we have them. And um, these two do have some scratches in the middle here. I do think it comes from um, some dirt that has been laying between them during the shipping and then they have been grinding a bit like this these two looks perfect I can't see any scratches at all some iron here but they look good these two larger ones are a bit scratched here in the middle, some minor scratches, but they look 10 times better than the one ones that I got delivered with the sliding blocks on. These two looks perfect except for some minor scratches in this end. So it seemed to be some kind of a lottery um, how scratch, scratched they are. I don't know how it will affect the performance, but feels good to have uh, as unscratched linear rails as possible. So, yeah, ball screws looks excellent. Slides very well. So let's uh, try some um, 
blocks on and see how how they slide the blocks has this kind of uh, plastic thing inside that keeps the balls from falling out during the transportation let's see if i can do this with one hand i think it's easiest to stand it up to mount it on the rail one just uh, pushes it and then the this plastic uh, thing will slide out like that i have now unpacked and test mounted the blocks and there seem to be some kind of correlation between the smoothness of the glide and the amount of scratches so these two ones um, have almost no scratches at all and they slide very smoothly Same with this one. These two had some more scratches and they don't slide as smooth. I have to push the rail down in order to not to have it moving so see it gets stuck hopefully it will get better in time after some um, use of it I heard someone say that it is possible to remove uh, a ball from it I don't know if it's possible but I heard it but yeah the ones without scratches slides very nice and smooth and same thing goes with uh, these uh, smaller ones these two had some scratches and you can see that uh, I have to push it down a bit in order to make it to slide this part here slides smooth this one here doesn't slide as smooth but it's still pretty good these two had not as much scratches and they slide much smoother so it kind of seems like a lottery if you get them with scratches or not it would be nice to if all the ones were moving like this but um, for the price I think that this is good value for the money anyways yeah that is pretty much it I will add comment down below uh, where I ordered them from and um, as well what the cost was these ones are super nice yep please like and subscribe the video and um, yeah these smaller ones are for the 
granite floor tile project and these large ones are for my 64 driver so these two will be the new x-axis and these two will be the new y-axis then I have some more air rails in the garage that I will use for z-axis so stay tuned for that updates in future videos. See you!